Good morning. This is the Daily Roar for Friday, November 13th. I'm CJ. And I'm Andres. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Are you in 10th or 11th grade? Do you have at least a 2.0 unweighted GPA? Are you currently on track for graduation? If so, Orange Technical College Dual Enrollment, otherwise known as OTC Dual Enrollment, may be something for you to consider. You'll spend part of the day at OTC campus earning college credit, industry certification, and career skills. Most programs are AP weighted. There's a free bus that goes from OTC campus that leaves from here and brings you back. At OTC, you can choose from more than 50 career options. Apply on now using the link we are showing you. Hello, welcome to Rodrigo's Reflection Place. Do you prefer being the person that orders the food at Wendy's or that gets the food at Wendy's? Do you prefer working your life like hard right now and then succeed and have fun all the way or do you prefer having fun right now and work hard your whole life? It's your choice. That's why you gotta give maximum effort. I do not like school, and a lot of people don't like school. It's a common thing between teenagers. But I'm a senior and I don't know if I'm gonna graduate and now I'm paying my debt. Do well in school, and I promise, I promise you it's gonna be worth it. What's better than a sweet, juicy orange? You can help Lake Nona Hosa compete at the state conference with your order of some fresh Florida fruit. All orders are taken online and shipped direct to you or your family and friends. Those orders are due by December 4th. Anyone can order by going to shop.floridaindianrivergroves.com. Use the code for Hosa 1022385 and your order will ship directly to any address in continental U.S. by December 25th. You know what day that is. You can also ask any host member for details about the fundraiser. Breaking out of Disney's Hollywood Studios, there is a brand new system to getting on Rise of Resistance. I know, it seems like it changes every single day, but here's the new tips on how to get on. As you can see, Nothing has really changed on the layout of the app, but there are some changes to times. And now you have to, if you want to get in early, you have to do it at 7. And anyone can do it, even if you're at home. But, mind you, you still have to have a reservation to the park. I tried this method at home, uh, basically standing next to my router, and uh, I got Route 5, so that's not that bad. So yeah, just... Just uh, make sure you're there early. We're going to have to wait a little longer to see the girls volleyball team win the state title. Due to tropical storm, Ada, the finals have been moved a few days later to Sunday, so you have a bit more time to wish them luck. A, a win means the first state title in school history, but they'll have to beat Lyman High School to do it. Good luck from all of us here at the Daily Roar. Metal Gear Solid 5 is my favorite stealth game. Its story is very, very, very simple compared to the other games in the series, but you can still talk for hours on end about the game. While the story is as convoluted as it typically is, the game begins to shine the moment the stealth gameplay starts. There are a lot of tools you can use as Venom Snake to help you throughout your stealth journey. The first tool is the Silent Pistol. This one is a bit overpowered, because one shot to the head immediately makes the enemy fall asleep. Another tool you have is the Cardboard Box. The Cardboard Box is probably the most famous tool from the entire Metal Gear franchise, because it's quite ridiculous. You just put on a Cardboard Box and hide in it. All in all, Metal Gear Solid V is a great stealth game, and it's one of my favorites. If you're bored during the pandemic and you want to try a video game out, I would suggest Metal Gear Solid 5. We'll wrap up with another online Netica tip. And this one you should never forget. What goes online stays online somewhere forever. 
I'm Andres. And I'm CJ. That's the teleprompter, and that's how I'm able to read this show and look at the camera at the same time. The lens is behind the words. Pretty cool, right? Okay, we're out.